He had no problem with going to First Division Oxford's manor ground. They went ahead after 51 minutes. When the ball came across from the left, it was Mark Harris who climbed high. John Cornforth turned the ball into the net. Six minutes later, a second goal was crucial, so you'd think. No one got to grips with Russell Coughlin's corner, and it was the head of Andrew Legg that made it 2-0. Well, there must have been something in the half-time tee, because a third goal in 15 minutes came from Oxford. Jason Bowen caught in the act of handling. The lifeline for the First Division club came in the shape of a penalty from Jim Magilton. It was a lifeline they grasped with 10 minutes remaining and they pulled themselves towards the shore. Gary Smart's free kick finished off by Joey Beauchamp. Extra time came and went. Swansea rode their luck and when it came to the dreaded penalty shootout, it was Keith Walker who sent 2nd Division Swansea into a fourth round home tie with Grimsby.